as a main chart from the time of pro app level, it's extremely easy. Uh, most times you probably have data already available for the different tasks that you might be working with. And you can easily cut and paste them from Word or Excel, put the task description in one in column A here, and then put the activities themselves, move over a column and down a row and start like, documenting the different activities. And then you can put in the times and so forth here. You can size them any way that you like. Uh, you can also enter uh, value added. Value added elements, just leave them blank. You don't have to identify them. You can put a V in if you want, but it's easier just to leave them blank. Put an R for required non-value added and N for non-value added activities. And you can see here we've got a complete list of all the activities in our process right here. So you just document them, each of the individual tasks, one after the other, the same idea. Identify the tasks and then identify the different uh, activities. Scroll back up to the top and then click on the send to Yamazumi right here. Your data will be sent out to Yamazumi chart and it's in Excel and you can print it out any size you want using all the normal Excel features. You can even go in and uh, start copying and pasting and moving the elements around. Well, it is a lot easier in the full-time pro professional to do that. You can do that directly on the Yamazumi chart itself here. But uh, this gives you the basic Yamazumi format that you would use perhaps to put on the end of the line to let the operators see uh, what their different activities are to be performed for each of the different processes. The Timer Pro applet itself is a subset of the full Timer Pro professional that includes PDA-based time study, Excel-based time study, video time study, line balancing, ergonomic analysis, standard data libraries and work instructions.